Hello everyone. In this video, I'd like to introduce you to a very special piece of software. I'm confident this will be an extremely useful tool for anyone working in an automotive repair garage. If you're running a garage, this is definitely a software you should have. It will provide great support in your daily repair tasks and help make your technical processes more efficient and professional. Speaking of features, I can say this software is truly versatile. It's compatible with almost every car brand available on the market today. It also helps us handle issues related to systems such as EGR, DPF, SCR, NOx, and even IMO, along with many other systems as well. You can see here on the software interface, the left column shows all the car brands that this software can work with. I've checked it carefully and honestly, I couldn't find any brand missing. It's almost completely full, covering nearly every manufacturer. When you need to work with a specific brand, you'll find all the ECU models used by that brand listed inside. The next step is to select the correct ECU model, then load the program file that we've already read before. After that, we can start working on it to fix the error or make adjustments. Once the repair is done, we simply save the modified file and write it back to the ECU. And that's it. I have to say, this software is very easy to use. The interface is simple, the steps are few and clear, so there's really nothing complicated about it. Now, let me show you a real example using an actual ECU file so you can see everything more clearly. Here, I'll be using a BMW file with the code EDC17C50. So we go to BMW and then select it. When the window appears, Please browse to the folder where your file is saved, then choose the correct file and click Open. Once the file is open, the software will automatically detect it and display all the sections that it can modify or repair, right here below. When these sections appear, we simply select the ones that we want to work on or fix. After finishing the repair, we save the modified file and then use an ECU tool to write the file back into the ECU. Please note, always use the same tool to write the file that you use to read it. For example, if you read the file using KTAG, then you should also write it back using KTAG. Now I'm going to show you how to install this software. It's actually very simple. First, open your web browser and type eqdesk.com. This is the official website of eqdesk. Next, go to the download section and get the latest version of the software. Once the download is complete, just extract the file and install it as usual, just like any other software.
After the installation is done, go ahead and open the program. If it doesn't start properly, that, that's because this software requires the .NET framework to run. On the screen, you'll see the exact version it needs. It's .NET Desktop Runtime. Click Download It Now, and once it's downloaded, install it on your computer. After that, open the software again, and it should run normally. Right now, this software is available in three different packages offered by the company. The first package is called Standard. It's priced at $1,000 with an annual renewal fee of $200. The second package is called Premium. It costs $1,300 and has an annual renewal fee of $300. The third package is called HP Plus, which stands for Horsepower Plus. It's priced at $1,500 with an annual renewal fee of $500. At the moment, my channel is receiving a special price offer directly from the company. So when you purchase the software through my channel, you'll get an instant 10% discount. If you're interested in this software, please contact me to get it at a special discounted price. You can find my contact information below this video in the description section. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you again in the next videos.